after the game, uh, you said, the coach said, get your block in gloves or something along those lines. Oh, yeah, right? for sure. Is that, I mean, are you preparing that, regardless of who that quarterback kind of that I mean, of yeah, with the back we got, you know, we always got to be ready for that. You know, with a guy that can make plays and make people miss like that, uh, we always got to be ready, you know, to to block in the run game. So uh, that's any given week for us. They say about the best teams, they can win in different ways. Yes. Obviously, you had a, a huge receiving day in week one. Yes. You've run the ball 53 times in week two. How much pride do you take in being able to be one of those teams that can beat teams differently? Yeah, man, that's every week. You got to be ready to adjust because, you know, every team plays a little different. So uh, you got to, you know, stick to the game plan, really, and just, you know, follow and execute the plays that are in that week. What sort of belief and buy-in is there when coach draws up a game plan like that? Yeah. It hasn't been seen in the NFL that many rush yards in the quarter since Tim Tebow's Broncos in like 13 years ago. Well, what sort of buy-in do you get when you hear, oh, we're going to run it how many times and then it actually Yeah. Works? Any given Sunday, like I said, you know, we, we got a back that can do that. So, like, we got to be ready to, you know, uh, do our job for him because it, it takes all 11 to win the game. So, uh, you know, whatever that game plan is, you know, uh, previous week before that, the coach struggled stopping the run. So, you know, uh, we had a great game plan for it, and, you know, we had to put our blocking gloves on. Are the Titans a little bit different defensively, though, than the Colts in that regard? Uh, I would say a little different, but I, I will say their do, DBs are really aggressive, you know, coming down on the run. Uh, so uh, we do got to be prepared for that and still be ready, you know, to do our 1-11 there. Was yesterday just kind of a rest day for you, just kind of rest, recover type? Uh... I guess you could say that. You feel good today? I feel good. Have you ever been a decoy as much in your career as you were last week? Uh, yeah, I have been, actually, yeah. I mean, in college a little bit, so, you know, because, um, you know, in college, you know, they may throw some double teams on you, so, you know, you got to play your role, you know, whatever week it is, you know, every week is different, so. What do you have to do to prepare for an even hotter day this Sunday? Hydrate, hydrate. Get some carbs, you know, and uh, just take care of your body. When does the hydrating start? Right now. Right. Yep. Does it help that you played a hot game last week? Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, just going down there to Tennessee, uh, that definitely helps us here, you know, being in Green Bay, you know, getting some heat, you know, to prepare for it.